Hi guys, welcome to the personal property tour for 64 James Street in Cellardyke. This is an amazing four bedroom, two reception, three bathroom, period property on three levels. It's even got a self-contained one bedroom apartment out the back and it's an amazing garden, tiered with decking to so you can sit in the sun all day long. What's great about it as well, it's actually on the Fife Coastal Path. Which means you are literally just along that road you're at Shore Street in Anstruther, so you're next, you can pop onto the beach, you can pop onto any location, the restaurants, the restaurants, the uh, chippies, um, the cafes, uh, and all the things that are available along there, plus the fact, if we just pop along the end of that road, right there and round the corner there, you're at the beach as well. Um, and that's what I love most about this property. So I'm gonna take you on the tour and let you see all about it here. Um, remember, this is just a personal property tour, so there's full details of this property in the link itself. Uh, it does have a garage out the back as well, which is ideal uh, if you've got off-street parking. Um, but you'll see there's a wee bit of restriction on it, um, because it is quite low, so it, uh, it accommodates for uh, possibly a lower-sized vehicle, but not, not exactly a 4x4, four four, but you'll see that yourself. So as you come in, a nice welcoming hall, um, and then off to your side in the sitting room, you know, what I love most about this, I think you can see it just right there. <laughs> it is extremely cosy and I've literally had that on for five minutes. So log burner as well. Um, you've got these nice shutters to the front that are all built in. Gives it that feature to the property. Nice and spacious and bright. I'm just stand here for a minute and get cosy and let you see the rest of the room. Uh, we're going to pop upstairs first, look at the bedrooms upstairs. Um, so downstairs, just quickly as I do this, plenty of storage in this property as well, that's what I love about this, there's storage under here. This is uh, access out to the rear uh, garden as well, but you can get out through the kitchen, which we will do the dining kitchen. Uh, I love this rope feature as you go up, and then I also love this, this beautiful double glazed window. Gives a lot of natural light into this stairwell. So on the first floor, off to my right hand side, we we'll have this amazing four piece bathroom with shower, thermostatic I might add. Now it has a thermostatic uh, system, it has a system boiler, so it's got a tank upstairs which will give you fantastic water pressure more than likely. And then we've got storage in this cupboard. And off into the first bedroom. And what I like about this, it's not just restricted to there, it also goes back behind the door as well. It's got real good depth to this room. Just let you see as I'm coming back out. See a bit more about it. And then we're off into the master bedroom. Again, the master bedroom's away back behind the door as we come round. There's that cupboard for storage, and then you have your ensuite bathroom in your master bedroom. So, ensuite bathroom, again, thermostatic shower over the bath. You can see the finished and extremely high standard. If you look at it from this angle, and then we'll pop upstairs to the next two bedrooms. So a nice spacious upper landing here. That's a walk-in cupboard there for good storage. Also houses the hot water tank and the system boiler. Off to the side here we have again you've got storage in there, um, plenty of storage in that cupboard and this is your shower room. Electric shower this time which is handy as well. And then one of your first bedrooms to here, double good sized double bedroom. And enter this bedroom. This bedroom is huge. Cupboard for storage. This bedroom's got some depth and it's absolutely massive in size. Big, big bedroom. So 
It's a huge room, isn't it? Okay, so let's walk downstairs. Again, you can see all these chrome handles and the doors as well. That featured window again on the second level. As we come down, we're going to go into the dining kitchen and then I'll take you out the back. So, great sized dining kitchen. Look at that dining area. That's a room in itself, really. And then you've got your kitchen to the rear. Again, you've got these nice shutters at the front. Gives it a nice feel to the property itself. Got that range cooker as well. And then the island for preparation in the middle. So plenty of cupboard space all around, freestanding American style fridge freezer. And it goes down out there. Now, I'm going to go out the back door this way. So what I noticed first of all is right in front of us all these outbuildings. So there is actually four outbuildings. There's a store here, there's a store here, there's a store here, and there's a laundry here. So we'll pop into our laundry. So washing machine, tub of dryer, sink as well. So your own laundry out here. And then you've got a wee decking area if you want to hide and just sit. And uh, you can get a power point there as well. So there's power points, so it's ideal for sitting in the sun. And just sitting, being nice and cosy. And if that's not enough, we're on to the upper. So up the top, we have this amazing decking up here and garden area. So up here you've got the decking, then along. As we go through, now there's your self-contained one bedroom apartment from the net loft out there. I'll take you in there in the garage and access to the rear. You see, show you the property from the rear in a minute. Um, and off to the side. And this decking as well, so it's huge, huge garden area. And then you've got the property itself, I'll show you from the rear. Looking down on it. You see all the brickwork and everything's well maintained as well. Pointing. So, off to the side here, we have a integral garage. You've probably got a wee workshop at the back here to be honest. Or something else, maybe a wee sunroom. Um, but you've got your garage, I mean it is a low ceiling. Um, I can uh, I can stand up in this. So literally, there you go, that gives you a good indication, I'm 5 foot 10 in terms of the height, but you probably get probably get your Aston Martin in here quite comfortably. And then we're going to pop into the one bedroom apartment at the back. This is separate access as well from the rear. Um, so you've got your dining kitchen. Sound covered there for storage, and you've got your access from the rear road upstairs to your lounge. So, a good sized lounge like that. We feature fireplace, my area nice and decorative. It's a nice sitting area as well. As you'll see at the corner there, you've got the shower room. So a good size shower room to go with this actually. Thermostatic shower. 
and your double bedroom. I'm convinced this is a super, super duper king because it looks the size of two massive single beds. So it's a huge room. And in terms of the size, go right back to the corner and show you around this way. And you've got an area for hanging your clothes as well. I'll just walk back out here. Let you see in the journey down. And we'll have one last look at the rear garden. As we go. So here we go. And literally, the sun is just going down over there. Um, behind there, but it's, it comes up over here and it sits on this bit all the time during the day, so it's nice and cosy. Okay, let's recap. Four bedroom, two reception, three bathroom, main house on three levels, finished an extremely high standard. You've got this beautiful garden and decking and all these outbuildings as well on a separate laundry. You've got that integrated garage to the rear. You could make something special of that, maybe even a wee sunroom off the rear there or a workshop. You've got the self-contained net loft, which is a one bedroom apartment. What more could you ask for? Further details in this post, you just need to click on the link. Uh, if you need to contact us, you can message us direct. You can contact us on 01333 421 774. And until next time, guys, be quick. I'm Jim Parker for Five Properties TV.